hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is jenny so guys um i hope you guys are doing good thank you so much for all your support before i start this video i just want to like take this opportunity to appreciate this beautiful queen like guys she's so beautiful see let's leave the hate and everything aside this lady is so beautiful she's a dark skin color is pumping like her melanin is it melanin or melanin color is pumping and one thing I, I i love about her is like i just love her personality i love the way she dresses she's just unique honestly when you look at her you will see um she has this um when you see her you see that queenship in her you see the vibe of a queen you know she's pretty she's educated and you know and I love her energy honestly i follow her bomba to bomba on instagram so you know a lot of people have been asking me what is her page on instagram this and that they want to follow her. if you want to follow her her instagram page is oma oba um underscore triple a so you can follow her on instagram she's very active on instagram you can follow her on instagram too you know so why i really made i'm making this video is because of the recent post she made she wrote a whole lot of things you know you might read it we just we we'll just read what she wrote together so that i'll just analyze why i'm making this video let me just read what she wrote on her instagram page so this is what she posted she said life is a massive journey and you must be the change you wish to see in the world I was giving my life because I am strong enough to live it. No one is me. Afole Shade Ashley Afola Kemi Aya Adimola and that is superpower. I always know one thing for sure. If you want the rainbow, you will have to put up with the rain. And still I rise and remain Aya Osha. She wrote a lot of Aya something something Yoruba stuffs. I cannot read it. You can just pause and read what she wrote. This word she wrote, this thing she wrote has a lot of meaning. It is talking to you that is hating her. You that is calling her name. This journey called life is a mass is is massive. And you that is watching this video must be the change you wish to see in the world. Stop talking down on people. Stop talking down on other women for you to be happy. She really passed a whole lot of strong message in this small piece she wrote here. I'm making this video not really um to, you know, I don't know how I feel about it. But why I'm making this video is because of the comments, the nasty comments, especially the hateful comments people are, you know, commenting on my, on my post about her. I think maybe... I just want to use this opportunity with this her write up to tell you that life is a massive journey. This life you see is a very massive journey, you know, and you must be the change you wish to see in the world. You can't just come and say you need love, you want um people to love you, whereas you cannot love another person that is close to you, whereas you cannot love another person. Maybe you wanted something. And that person, that person, the thing you wanted to be is what the person is. Instead of you to rejoice so that the thing will get to you, you know, you start being maybe jealous and, you know, what is there? If you really want a change in your life, you it has to start from you. You that is watching this video, you that is saying nasty things about this beautiful queen. Maybe you wish to be a queen and you are not opportune to be the queen now she's the queen she she has found favor in the eyes of the king you are now talking down on her you know because she's now a queen you know that she cannot come out on the internet and answer you back or maybe at the end of the day throughout your life your lifetime in this earth you will not even get to meet her or talk to her or interact with her or something you can only talk about her on the internet any opportunity you see that people is posting something about her you just come there and talk and talk 
how do you feel when you talk down on your fellow women and the most painful thing about these things is they are women how do you feel that change you need in your life that change you are we are talking about that everybody should change start loving one another it needs to start from you you that needs that change you need did that change needs to start from you first love your fellow human you know being alive is a very big opportunity i so much love this hair right up if you can pause up you can pause and read and meditate on these words like this is a very powerful strong message straight from a beautiful dark-skinned queen honestly let's appreciate this lady let's let's show her love let's stop the hate not only about her even in your daily dealings stop hating people i know um in this life it's not everybody you see that you would like right i know but fine if you don't like people don't don't say things that will hurt them don't say things things that when they wake up and read they will cry don't say things that can make people to be depressed don't say things that will make people to you know that can cause people depression and or something that can make people to start thinking of negative stuff that change you have been asking for should start from you yes i'm talking to you you that is watching this video same you that will come to the comment section to call her uh, whatever you want to call her same you that will come to this comment section to um say use bad words against her i'm talking to you that change you are looking for should start from you and i love the ending part where she wrote i always know one thing for sure if you want the rainbow you have to put up with the rain you see in your life there are some people that you don't like right there are some people that um when you see them eh, because of their character it's not as if you don't like because of their character so she is telling you that if you want the rainbow you have to put up with the rain so even if we have some people in our lives that we don't really like but it's not necessary for us to be showing them hatred because we don't like their character it's not even as if we don't like them because we don't like their character so we have to learn how to put up with them you can't kill them some of some some of you that is watching this video your family members or your friends or people you know has a very nasty character instead of you to be hating them learn how to you know adapt with them learn how to coexist with them instead of you know sending bad energy instead of you bad mouthing them instead of you making negative comments learn how to you know adapt with things that you don't like you, you understand what i mean so i don't know maybe i'm ranting too much maybe i'm talking too much but honestly guys let's show this beautiful young queen love and moreover guys it's not really a crime to be a single mother most people like if people that is bashing her at 10 eight of them are mainly saying she's she um she has a baby she cannot be a queen no you can say that being a single mother is not a sin being a single mother does not uh, mean that you can enjoy what single ladies are enjoying enjoyment is made made for everybody both small old married unmarried um baby mamas single mothers orphans widows enjoyment is made for everybody you understand for the king to see her and love her and been loving her since 2017 that means there is something unique about her that means there is something that we cannot say it's only the king that that knows that ah this lady possesses something something very powerful something very unique so you and i don't have any power you and i don't have any say to start castigating her or, or to start you know talking using bad words against her it's not done you know and yes there is something again i want to talk about a lot of people are saying that i am omo ibo i'm not supposed to talk about the king that's the same thing we are still talking about are we not one are we not nigerians are nigerians are nigerians not entitled to talk about um even even people even people that do bloggers in united states 
that are not even from Nigeria do talk about Nigerians. So have you ever you that is watching this? We are always saying the Omi will stop talking about Yoruba King. Have you um have you like tried to talk to those Americans from other countries that normally talk about Nigerians? Have you? You've not though, but because I'm Igbo, because um, I'm Igbo, you are Yoruba, you'll be telling me that I'm an Omi Igbo. I'm not, I'm not qualified to talk about the king. See, you, sh you guys should know something about blogging. You can talk about anybody, but you don't need to insult that person. If you want to talk about people, you talk about them respectfully without, you know, bringing them down. You just talk about anything that concerns them that you know and most especially this is a famous king this is a, a very respectful king in yoruba land so he is one of the rest uh, as in he's one of the famous king in nigeria so people are meant to talk about him you know people all eyes are on him even ordinary um celebrities people are talking about them talk more of a famous king people still talk about them they will read it and pass they know that they are famous that's that's why being a celebrity or being a famous person is not an easy job so please let's stop all this you are on me boy you're not supposed to talk about our king you know we are nigerians you know even you that is watching this video you've been talking about the current situation what buari is doing abby have buari attacked you and said you are not from aosa or you're not from the northern side that you you're not entitled to talk about him no this is a king a king is a king he has authority you know he see this he, this um only of ife his authority did not even stop only in yoruba land he has authority in other places because he is a king a king will always be a king you know so i think i'm ranting too much but i just want to like touch small small things that have been going on since i started posting about this beautiful lady you know so Thank you so much thank you so much guys for watching please i don't mean to offend anybody i'm just speaking from my heart and my heart is so pure my heart is so pure i don't hate honestly i don't hate i don't have hate in my heart so i'm just speaking my heart i'm sorry if any of the words i use um that it did not sit well with you i'm so sorry in advance and you try to understand that i'm just a human all right thank you so much guys and i will see you guys on my next video please stay safe oh